Hello everybody, E here. It is Thursday. Um, the next Thursday Theorist will be coming in the next two weeks. But I wanted to go ahead and give you guys some King content. I didn't have enough time to go through my spoiler discussion video for Salem's Lot. It's it's going gonna, it's gonna to take me a while. It might be 45 minutes to an hour long video. Because I love that book. love talking about that book. But what I want to do today is... Uh, I want to do a more of a discussion than a cemented list. Uh, these lists are everywhere. Everyone has their own way. They like reading the Dark Tower series. But this is the extended reading list for the Dark Tower series as far as I'm concerned. I'm sure that there's going to be much discussion. I'm sure there's going to be plenty of people saying, hey, no, you need to read this first or you need to read this after or whatever it may be. Also, I know some of you just like to listen to these videos, so I'm actually going to go through book by book and list them. Um, also, there will be down there in the doobly-doo, in the description, <laughs> not in the comments, um, but in the description, there will be, uh, this list will be posted there also. I am completely open to any and all discussion. There's only one thing that I'm having an issue with, uh, and I, the only way I can think of figuring it out is to actually read the books in this order but we'll get to that when we get there but right now this is the way that I would read the Dark Tower um like I said make sure also be sure there's going to be spoilers down in down in the in the chat down in the the comment section down in the doobly-doo uh there's going to be spoilers so please be aware that if you go down there you might run into spoilers for books that you haven't read yet so be cautious um, we're going to also try to keep this video as short as possible so that, you know, try to keep it all a condensed version. Um, so, right off the bat, The Little Sisters of Alluria, as far as the timeline is concerned, it comes before The Gunslinger. Now, I won't be spoiling any of the reasons why these connect in this video. We will go into more, once we have a concrete, this is concrete, this is the way it should be read order. Once we as a community has deci have decided on that, we'll put it up online somewhere. Um, once we have that, then we will go into spoilers. Uh, so, number one, The Little Sisters of Illyria, because it it's, happens even before The Gunslinger. Number two, The Gunslinger. Number three, The Drawing of the Three. Number four, The Wastelands. I, 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 I'm, I'm kind of stuck on this one. This isn't actually what I was talking about earlier, but I'm kind of stuck on whether or not I would have you guys read it before the Wastelands, or right after the Wastelands, um, or much, much later as it ties into the next uh, couple of books. At number five, you're going to read two short stories, Night Surf and One for the Road. Both of those are in the Night Shift collection. At number six, The Eyes of the Dragon. At number seven, The Talisman. Now here, I, I, I firmly believe you can read The Talisman and Black House back to back if you want to, but I honestly don't recommend it um, because the Black House, ha well Black House, not the Black House, I always get that wrong. Black House has some very important tie-ins to other books down the line, so uh, you want to hold off on that one, you want to split it up. Plus The Talisman and Black House, even though they do have the same main character, they really don't tie into each other all that much. They don't even really go to the same places, oddly enough. Um, then at number 8, you're going to read The Stand. Right before number 9, you're going to read Wizard and Glass. So you're going to go from The Stand directly into Wizard and Glass for the best possible experience. After Wizard and Glass, you're going to read It, Insomnia, Bag of Bones, Rose Matter, Desperation, The Regulators, Hearts in Atlantis, and here's where I come in to tie in my own universe. You're going to want to go the Tommyknockers and Dreamcatcher. I tie those into the Dark Tower. We will discuss more of that in the actual uh, spoiler video when we get together and you know we discuss all this. We'll we'll talk about that in the spoiler video. Um, but if you're a fan fan of the Thursday Theorist show that I do, then you already know why I put those books on this list. After Dreamcatcher, you're going to go right into The Outsiders. So you got the trilogy right there, I feel. The Tommyknockers, Dreamcatcher, and The Outsider are all important to each other. Um, and The Outsider, as far as the Dark Tower one, I had somebody mention why, um, you know, they didn't understand why I love The Outsider as much as I do. And it's because it brings the whole universe together. Um, after The Outsider, you're going to go directly into The Wind Through the Keyhole, Wolves of the Kala, Song of Susanna, 
And then we're going to slam the brakes. Yes, between the sixth and last book, the seventh book, we're going to pump those brakes and we're going to read Black House, Revival, and then we're going to read The Dark Tower. I strongly feel that Black House and Revival need to be read... So, I would say read them before Wolves of the Kala, but I feel they only really tie into that final Dark Tower book. Um, if you would like to d discuss why you feel differently, and I know there is uh, differing opinions online, if you would like to discuss that, I'm completely open for that. Then right after the Dark Tower, right after the Dark Tower, you're going to go back and reread The Gunslinger. It's nice and short, and it is a perfect, perfect period to that super insanely long sentence. So, once again, down in the doobly-doo, I want to discuss why uh, you would read these books in different order. Again, I will put all of these books down in the description of this video. I'm just trying to keep this video as short as possible. I know it sounds like I'm rambling. I apologize. And I probably could cut it shorter. But uh, there's all this information I want to get out. But let's have a discussion down there. Um, if you're going to say something that is a massive uh, story spoiler, please say spoiler at the beginning of your comment. But until next time, I have been E, you have been you. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye!